Good morning. Welcome to the Lewis Daily Garden Tuesday morning. Let's get going on this row here because there's a lot of cool things. Let's start out with this crazy colored bloom of free ticket from Judy Davison. <laughs> Orangey brown. <laughs> it's unusual. Here we are with Jamie Gossard's A Little Slice of Heaven. And it's very pretty. Um, bouncing out here, this is Be Cool from Guy Pierce today. I'm impressed with Be Cool. I saw it in Floyd Cove, the year of introduction, and I was impressed then. Um, yeah. Here's a nice bloom of Pray Without Ceasing from Carol Emmerich. It's very pretty. I cross Pray on uh, Be Cool. Good watermark. Um, Sonic Tempo looks nice today. Sonic Tempo from Guy Pierce. Oh, and right to its right, here is Atomic Blonde from Guy Pierce. Atomic Blonde. Very pretty. Behind it here, this is Ring 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 from Guy Pierce with that really distinct pattern. I like this daily a lot as well. Okay. This is the uh, star of the garden today. This is my seedling, and it's got downward spiral and another seedling that has downward spiral in it. It's got a really cool pattern. I like it. That's why I saved it. Look at um, Burly Bobcat from Bart Beck today. Putting on a little toothy show there for you. This one looks cool. Give you a little close up there. That's a nice daily. All right, how about some fractured today? Fractured's looking good. Let's bring this bloom in. Pretty good. There's that one. You can see the different colors going on there. And I think I'll bring it to a close with Dr. Robert Burkhart from Guy Pierce. It's a real pretty red toothy. All right, guys, I'll work on a front yard part two. And here we are in the front. This one red, as soon as I came in to the garden, caught my attention. This is a red fortune time stolen heart. Really pretty red. All right. Oh. <laughs> this is an interesting seedling. This is ripples and reflections times too little too late. And it almost looks identical to too little too late. I find that interesting. You can tell which parent was more dominant. There's a seedling out of mom's kind heart and dragon heart stone. It's a very tall red. Not much teeth, but pretty. And then here's the pattern row out of downward spiral and Pharaoh's arrow. I've been drawn to this one, not because of the pattern, but because of the height of the scape. I don't know. Let's move on. Here's one that, eh, it's a neither nor. This is out of everybody wants some and all things to all men. Eh, you know. Here's that pattern seedling out of ominous and inner rumble. Amazing pattern, but short. All right. 
Let's see here, where are we going next? Looking for the best, the best of the best. Oh, it's still cold, so some day lilies are stuck together. Okay, I guess we'll come back here. I'll show you Kirsten Hatfield's Jeepers Creepers. I like this daylily a lot. Uh, it's got a nice tall scape, consistent pattern. It's cool. Uh, hmm. Yeah, pass on that. Take a look at Solomon Sunrise from Subhana Ansari. Look at the pattern. Nice pattern today. That's cool. I'm saying that's cool a lot today. Here's my ceiling out of Stolen Heart and Roar with Pride. Looks like we got a purple here. This might might be Rulers of Nations. I'm not sure. Nice pattern today and Tim Bell's Lord of Creation. That's nice. Um, yeah, there's my uh, ceiling out of Dr. Francis Baker today. Let's see here. It's a little water spotted, but there's a giant red bloom of Heavenly Queen of Sheba. It is big flower. Um, yeah. We'll go by All Things to All Men from Carol Limerick, a great parent. And look at the pattern today here on Too Little Too Late. Getting a ton of bloom. Ton of bloom. Easy pod setter, too. Great day, Lily. <laughs> 